The first cannabis-derived drug is about to hit store shelves. Right Aid says it could start carrying a Pediolex if it gets approval from the feds. It treats seizures for those who live with one of two rare forms of epilepsy. A local teenager is among the first to be treated. His parents tell 13 News Now. Reporter Megan Chin, this was their last option. Like most 16-year-old boys, Caleb Thomas likes playing video games and sleeping in. <laughs> He's he's a sleepy head, right? I think most teenage boys are, though. <laughs> His mom, Tracy Thomas, says her son is unique, though, because he's one of the first people in Virginia to participate in a clinical study, a study used on Monday by the FDA to approve the drug Epidiolex. The drug helps stop the amount of seizures in people with severe epilepsy, a neurological disorder. Epidiolex uses non-psychoactive marijuana, which can be a touchy topic for many. And personally, I had to come full circle. I mean, I was raised that, you know, marijuana is a drug and cannabis is a drug and that's a no-no. But four years ago, Caleb was on 20 medications to slow down his seizures. I had a pretty big one, of course, and I was a little bit dizzy. With Epidiolex, Tracy says Caleb has half as many seizures as he used to. Nothing has helped him like this had. The Drug Enforcement Administration is expected to make it so doctors can prescribe Epidiolex in 90 days. Severely epileptic patients as young as two years old can take the drug. So for us, this is a big advantage. CHKD's neurologist Michael Strunz says the FDA approval is a big move. So this is the first uh, chance we have as a neurologist to say I have a chemical that I know exactly what you're going to get. After those 90 days, the drug could help many more families like Kayla and Tracy. <laughs> I feel like I got my baby back to some degree. In Suffolk, Megan Shin, 13 News Now.